ladies and germs, it is Joker here, and today we are starting a brand new survival world. And before we go any further, I want to wish you all a happy new year. Today is the 1st of January. Can you believe it? Wow. Oh, so we're going to have many, 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 many years of fun on this world. I have been sat on this world for probably about six months. Um, I haven't actually done anything with it due to... Um, the main base idea I've had to work out and creative, but I will explain that later in a time lapse. So, one of the reasons why I've actually picked this world is because we have a guardian temple just there, and many, many, many of you have asked me for a guardian temple, well, guardian farm, so we will get to that. We have a village right next to spawn, which is absolutely wonderful, so first night, once I've got enough blocks i will be blocking those up and about 200 blocks in that direction there is a skeleton spawner so we can get xp nice and easy and we can get straight over to building which will be on an island in about 500 blocks in that direction. oh no sorry uh about 100 blocks in that direction i think it is about yeah about 100 blocks so and before we go any further with this episode, because it is a new year, and I think it's time I had a new skin. I do apologise for anybody that's scared of clowns. Aha! Check my new skin out. You will have also noticed that I have changed my profile picture and the channel's header. So, please do check out the links in the header. There will be my Facebook my discord and my twitter accounts they are pretty much dead at the minute but with you guys messaging and telling me how this series is going hopefully we'll have plenty more activity on it anyway i think it's time that i got myself ready and you guys have probably seen a thousand youtubers do this before so i'm going to do it in a first person time lapse and while i'm doing that i am going to talk to you guys about how this series is going series is going to start and progress and what the overall plan for the series is so without further ado run that time lapse okay so the plan for this series is going to be uh, redstone based and when i say redstone based i mean every build that we do will have an aspect of redstone in it and at least one episode at least every episode i want to do one thing that is redstone but there will be building and we are going big as far as building goes. One, so that we've got plenty of room for redstone. And two, so that you can get more detail. The bigger the build, the more detail that you can get. Now, our main base idea that I will be doing in episode three is loosely based around Bruce Wayne's manor and how that he's got many different entrances or, well, not so much he has many different entrances, the different type of entrances that we have seen through the Batman universe from the grandfather clock in the animated series to uh, Christian Bale's Batman where he uses the piano to get into a room. I'm still working the redstone out for the piano because it is actually quite difficult. But like I said, uh, it is going to be loosely based. We will do a bat cave build and hopefully if I've got all my redstone and everything correct, we should be able to build almost like a computer system that will turn on and off the farms for us. Ah, sorry, I missed a bit. Our farms are going to be on different levels, hooked up with redstone, and in the cave build itself, we will have a system so that we can operate all the farms from the cave itself, so that there is no having to go down 10 different floors to go get it, and our storage system will also be automatic. I'm going to use a mix between Tango's storage system and a bulk storage system so that once the system is full it will then go through the bulk storage system. If there is no spaces in the bulk storage system uh, it'll go to trash basically. Um, and we are looking at having every single item. Well, that's what I'm hoping anyway. But like I said, we are going to be doing other builds, not just this Bruce Wayne Manor. 
we will also be doing a Westworld build. Now, for you younger viewers, you won't know what this is. For you older ones, you're going to be like, oh, wow, this would be cool. And I might do the underground of Westworld, at least one level of it anyway. Um, but I more want to be focused on the fact of the Western theme build. Because I do like Westerns. And cowboys, guns, Indians, horses, you know, that type of thing. <laughs> And one of the main um, things, and will be an ongoing build entirely through this series, will be our transport system. Now, yes, we've got Elytra, but I want to go one step further. I want it so that we've got boat roads, we've got train lines, and we've got uh, fly flying tunnels, basically. Now, I will be building, and when I say train lines, I do mean I'm going to build a train. I do apologise, my phone's going off. Right, where was I? Oh yeah, train builds. So, I will be modelling in Minecraft different um, steam mo locomotives, actually on tracks, and then underneath the locomotive's tracks is going to be our minecart rails, which will, hopefully, uh, I can get it so that we can, like, pick our destinations from the station and it will send us in that way um, and we'll be able to go to multiple places from each station and vice versa from all the others but I do believe I might be running out of time so let's get back to the world and let's see what I've been doing so ladies and germs after that lovely mining session I'll show you what I've got Plenty of resources to keep us going for now, and 27 diamonds that I actually had to go into another cave to find. Right, but I think our first job will be to try and find somewhere better to stay, because, well, this area is not exactly safe. And, well, you know, mobs, and I don't do well with mobs, so I think I'm going to go and commandeer one of the villagers' huts. Oh, I need that egg. We're going to make a chicken farm later and I'll also run you through the redstone of that and if you didn't see in that time lapse I did secure the villagers unfortunately one of them may have got eaten by a zombie maybe two maybe even three but anyway uh, I'm going to commandeer these two on the outside <clears throat> due to I'm far enough away to attract the zombies to me rather than they get attracted to the villagers over there. The hell was that? Okay, never mind. But yeah, I think I'm going to commandeer this one for our base. And. Hmm. Yep, I think that'll be good. Okay, so let me move my stuff over and I will see you shortly. So. As you can see, I have extended this building out by two blocks, and the same with that one. Uh, that's because I need the extra room for the redstone going in it, and this room mainly just so that um, it's got a little bit more protection, like it's a bit further down. If I just show you, why is it I can never ever make that jump on camera? Right, so, it's not pretty, I know, but here's all my diamonds and stuff in here and then down here I'll pop a temporary enchanting room down so we can get ourselves some nice diamond armor but like I said before we even do that oh actually I need uh, three of these and I've got to go get some obsidian so yeah wonder what I'm doing hmm uh, I will see you in a minute when I've got some obsidian Mm. Mm. Oh, it is a fine day in my world, and uh, it's time to go to the nether. Yes, for first episode, and we're going to the nether. We are off our knot. Uh, probably the reason why I call myself Joker. But anyway, we aren't going to put the nether portal anywhere near our current location due to Blaze and Zombie Pigman, and I don't fancy having to deal with... So, so we're going to go over to where we first enter the world. 
and this is purely so that we have a safe place and you spawn here anyway so if we ever need to go anywhere we've actually got a safe location one, two, three, four. Oh, we've even got obsidian left over. So, here we go. That was not the best start. Oh, God, there's a gust over there. Oh, gotta be quick. Even get as much as I possibly can without getting shot in the face. So I'm really quiet, I'm concentrating so I don't get myself killed right now. Um, me and the nether go together as well as chocolate spread on a brick sandwich so yeah <laughs> right let's call that good I'm going back to the overworld uh, I've got some stuff that needs crafting and I will be back with you once it's all crafted and we are ready to go okay then ladies and germs let's get on with today's build and first thing i need to do is remove two blocks here oh sorry i've got to show you what we need everything on the bottom row of my inventory is what we're going to need and that lava bucket just there right we need that there right this block out so we can get up here i need a hopper in the back of that chest i then need glass there with a half slab in front of it I like a soap and then I don't know if it's a dispenser or a dropper that we need so I'm going to use a dispenser to and then we need to run a hopper into there lovely and uh, give bud because the last thing I want is the chickens that are in here to out. Then we want a block there. Block. That's where the lava is in. Again, so we need a block, block, block. Uh, so. Data will go there let's place a block there and stone dust bring it across a there which then should power the dropper let's find out that's a no hmm what did i do wrong I thought that, well, first of all, why did that not fire in the first place? Oh, yeah. That's why I brought two. You need that. Otherwise, the signal's not strong enough to that piece of Oh, you're in the Yep, you. Okay. 
extremely well. I must have built one of these chicken farms a thousand times. And that block. Hmm. Build these again. Oh. Where's that? That's it. Ah. Excuse me, Mr. Hall. Then there we turn the system constant. So I Um, yep. Okay. I'm going to go absolutely. Ice lava, ice lava, ice lava, ice glass. Oh. Hey, that wasn't so hard now, was it? Well, yeah, it was. Yeah. That top block you now. There we go. I'd say let's put some torches in there, but I haven't got any now because the thing just. Bump and bump and bring the eggs. Like seriously, we're gonna put a door. On. Yeah. Three eggs. What do you reckon our chances? Are? I think it's one in a. We don't get any luck. Over. One. Two, three. Okay, I'll move some chickens over, but I do believe that that is all the time I have for today. So, ladies and gentlemen, I do hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, hit that like. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe. You can also contact me with ideas and things like that via my Twitter or Discord channel. The links will be in the description or even on the Facebook channel. So, anyway, ladies and germs, that is all I might have for today. I've been Joker, and I will see you in a mini honey. Oh, that's all for now.